Welcome to Mechanical Tutorial. I am going to teach you different techniques in SOLIDWORKS for mechanical engineers. I am going to train you different modules like part modeling, surface modeling, sheet metal enclosure design, plastic components design, product design, reverse engineering, simulation and many more tips and tricks in SOLIDWORKS. Hi, today I am going to explain shell with multi thickness faces. Left side you can see the shell with uniform thickness and right side shell with multi thickness. See here shell with uh, multi thickness you can create shell feature with a uh, different thickness for different faces. So I am going to show you with an example see here there is a shell with uniform thickness and uh, the shell component with different thickness see you can see the difference here and when I make the cross section there is an uneven thickness at the base sides. So, I am going to explain this. See here. See generally when we apply shell feature for example, select the shell command and simply say ok. So, you cannot see any difference, but when we make the cross section there is a uniform thickness see here this is uniform thickness of 5 mm see when I make the extrude cut see the cut which I have made from the top view see this is the cutout so when I make the cutout You can see this material is removed here. So, when I move this extrude cut inside, see here, it is a closer feature. See, when I make the cross section, see here, there is a uniform thickness. Now, I am going to edit the shell feature. and select this top face and say ok. So, the material is removed from the top face. I want to remove this side also for example. So, what I am going to do is I am going to select one more face. So, this face and this say ok. See. So, I am removing this face. Now, I want to make this face of 3 mm and say ok. See here, there is a non-uniform thickness. And when I select this face, see I have to select here and I am going to increase to 8 mm. So, I am going to take cross section, see here, this thickness is, you can see here 5 mm and this 
side thickness is 3 mm so when i check the bottom face so it is 8 mm you can see here 8 mm so the non uniform thickness of different places can be applied through multi thickness settings see when i select this face this face is 3 mm when i select this face is 8 mm and other faces are 5 mm so this is how we can make multi thickness in shell feature and this is mostly useful during plastics components but mostly useful for 3d printing when we make prototypes so this is brief about shell with multi thickness faces thanks for watching